Right up. <laughs> 1971 F100 I bought I'm trying to get it out of here but front brakes are locked the hell up and it soaks the sucker and penetrating all all that kind of stuff it is locked yeah she is locked up uh huh but it's a little bit rusty, yeah. but it's, it's a good Sweet truck. Sweet looking truck. truck. <laughs> it, it, it's been repainted a few times because you can see in the paint right there. It's like a lime green. I uh, know that. This is just a repaint oh, with a rattle right. can. Yeah, rattle can. Rattle can. This is the original hood. The cab's original. I know that. That door different. The bed's different. I'm not sure whether this fender is. And then the fender over there is different. The door is different. <laughs> Oh, that has been in a wreck at some point, but it's working on getting this. It's working on getting this drum off, which is currently stuck on there really well. I'm not sure how to get it off. Been pounding on it for a while, and it is not coming now. I'm gonna try for a little bit longer, and then we'll just show a video around the truck or something. Yeah. Because, well, not much else to record aside from that. Yeah. Gonna need, gonna need a new cab mount right here. Worry about that cab mount. Uh. Yeah, and then new fender. I'm not gonna bother replacing that. I'm just gonna get a whole new fender. New door. I want, I want to make this thing look nice. <laughs> Bed is gonna need a new floor in it, so I'm gonna do wood, and then gonna gotta replace the tailgate. Typical on these ones. But yeah, I'm gonna keep down for a few minutes and come back when you get that off, or we're just get showing the truck. Well, we weren't able to get the brakes off. It is seized on there, good. <laughs> but I have to replace the grill because it's dented right. Right here and here. Got headlight bevel are nice and good. The headlights are good. Keep the chrome front bumper because it's straight and not dented. Gonna keep the hood and stuff. Ugh. Ah! The hood on the inside is a little rusty. Have to replace this whole core support and that fender over there, that whole side. Got a 360 SE with a two barrel in it. Got power steering, manual brakes. Got a horn, I don't know if it still works. Um, yeah, this fender has been replaced. The fender over there has been replaced. This door has been replaced. It, it's um, like lime green or like pistachio green. Oh, mirror, but yeah, you can see it right there. The bed is the same. It, it's lime green, you see, and then it's dark um, emerald or whatever green. All the trim's still on you know, it. This back trim just dripped down a bit. You also see on the inside of the door right here, lime green, it was dark. And it's definitely, the tag's definitely been replaced on it. Because... This, that tag does not match the color of the truck. Hot in the inside. This is the original cab. There's a pretty big dent in the back of it right here. I have to fix. Got a sweet ladder rack. Three spoke racing wheel, which is awesome. This thing is locked up, so it's going to have to be. Um, have to take out the filler neck right in here. Pull this out and get a new neck. Y'all have all four original hubs. Two, the two front ones are in there. Dash gonna have to be replaced. I'm gonna just try and clamp the steering wheel and get a new center cap for it. Keeping the original radio and AC. Well, not AC, heating. Keep the, I'm gonna try and restore the factory. 
Gonna get a white interior. The only thing that's not fake, I'm gonna do a Confederate flag headliner in this baby. I'm gonna repaint the door panel. They're a bit rusty. This is not quite working very well. The window is locked up, so I'm gonna take the panel off to get that. Brakes are seized. Throttle pedal, not sure what it is, but I think the link linkage is broken. Window wipers work. And that's it for the inside. Still have all the original trim on it, which is awesome. Got this ladder rack, which I'm gonna clean up and repaint black, nice gloss black. Still has the custom badge on it, which is still in good shape. This reflector's gonna need to be replaced. Gonna reuse the tail light stuff, cause it's still good. Tailgate is toast. See right here, it's got a hole in there. I'm gonna replace, I'm gonna put this badge back on here. Right there. I'm gonna repaint this bumper matte black or white. Yeah. Tail gets a little bit stiff. The inside right here, along here is toast on it. Probably try and find a replacement tailgate. I'm gonna replace the bed deck, as you can see. In here, it's rusted, there's a hole right there. I'm all ding in the bed, not too big of a deal. <clears throat> yeah, original center caps are still on it. I'm going to repaint the rims white. I'm going to get another set of these tires for it. Exactly the same. Also the bed rest, you can see it real bad right in here. Right there. Right along this edge. See it all along in there. I'm going to cut the bedding out and do a wood deck in this thing. Not factory, but it'll look pretty good. Minor rust hole in the passenger side cap corner. Um, might have to replace this piece of trim right here because it's getting a little bubbly. Oh. Not sure if this window works now it is frozen up uh, door hinges don't want to stay yeah it's got aftermarket speakers in it have to replace all the um door seal there are a bit of holes in the um floorboard I'm gonna have to replace that. Rocker is actually still there. I can feel it. Um, it's, I'm holding this door. It's not wanting to stay open. Yeah, I pointed out already there is. This door had a rust hole, so I'm gonna replace it. It's, e it's just easier than just getting it. It's easier to get a new door than do this. I'll, I'll save the door, replace it eventually. Get it patch it eventually but for now gonna get a new door they must have send it right here the cow is actually in good shape all the other yeah this window seal is dry rotted you can see got the original antenna you can see right here is ford f1 or ford 100 which is an f100 yeah, you can also see right here, I'm going to have to do a little bit of work on the inside of the hood. That's Karsten. Hi. He has his own YouTube channel. What is it? Karsten Becker, 76. Yeah. Check it out. He posts trains and other stuff. I'm going to have to get a new battery cable because I was taking the battery out. and Well, that happened. That's not good. Keep the radiator. I'm gonna 
great kind of shit. Whatever. Next year, I'm planning on taking this to the Portland Roadster show. Put it right next to my Model T pickup. Yeah. My This dude's got a Model T pickup, which is awesome looking. Nothing special. Yep. Found it last year. Yeah, I'm gonna take, get the inside. I'm gonna get this running and drive up all on the road. Do the interior, and then after the roadster show, I'm gonna take it back, put it in the barn. I'm gonna tear it down to the frame. I'm gonna take all the panels off and everything, frame off, and I'm gonna take the engine out, repaint it, get a new carburetor, probably a. Well, get a new carburetor and, um, shoot, I'm, my mind's blanking right now. New, in, new manifold. That's for a four barrel. Get a four barrel Holly. And then, get an Edelbrock intake. I'm going to have to get a new master cylinder. I'm going to do the engine bay black. I'm going to keep the original color of, um, Regis Red and Wimbledon White. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put AC in this thing, possibly. I'm not sure. And I'm gonna actually board a 360F to a 390 so that it's got a little bit more power. And also, the 390 is basically just a underboard 360. So, or no, the 390 they board out 360 pretty much. So. Yeah. Last time this thing was on the road was 05. July of 05. The last time this thing ever drove. So. Got quite a store. Actually, got, still got the chrome trim on the hood. Lettering still there. All the windows are still good in it, which is nice. Yeah, these mirrors are off of 73. I'm going to get the original mirrors and put them back on it because, well, to be honest, it, I think it had the West Coast mirrors. I forget what they're called, but tow mirrors on it. You can see right there, and then I'm out of right there. I'm going to have to replace these in there. I'm not sure whether this door is still good or not. It looks like it's still good on this bottom part here. The handle still works. Yeah, you can see the cab is originally. This is what the Ridges Red, I think, is supposed to look like now. It all faded and looks like this. And that's pretty much it for what idea they have right now. I'm, gonna, I'm keeping it two-wheel drive. I want to make it four-wheel, but I think it'll be cooler two-wheel drive. Cause most people convert these to four-wheel, so they're Two-wheel drives are a bit cooler. I also still have the cigarette lighter in it, which might be able to still work. Clean it up. Ugh. Put that back in. Got the corn thing there. Original radio in it. I think that's original. I'm not sure. It has... Five hundred, uh, yeah, five. However many original miles, I can't tell right now. I'm leaving. That. But got parking brakes, five inch. Got the dimmer switch, which I'm really excited about. My '97 Dodge doesn't have that. Ow! I have to replace that light cover when it's back there. Get, I mean, I get the seat reupholstered because. Well, it's still relatively good. And the ladder rack, I'm going to re repaint it. And I'm going to get a, I'm going to take this bar out and put it up here, going across to the back. I'm going to get um, snap, so snaps put on here, and I'm going to have a custom vinyl made for this so you can like snap them on and it'll be like a camper and that'll be cool and this also isn't the original this isn't an original rack it's 
quality welding in Newburgh, Oregon or something. Yes, the uh, 1971 F100 Custom. Actually, look at the door tag right here. And, yeah. 31 Custom. Gonna be a sweet truck when it's finished. Huh. And he's got a crew cab or a. 79 Dodge Power, I guess. Yeah, the crew cab, right? Or yeah, the, the, the crew cab. Yeah, that he's got to fix, which is up in. 150. Yeah, it's... San, um... Pendleton. No, it's in Cove. It's in Cove, Oregon. Yeah. Is that, or is that where your C-10 is? No. Oh, that's where my Dodge is. Yeah. But yeah. He's got a couple projects. Might record that. Yeah. My motorcycle is not, um... And it works right now. Because, well, I gotta get sand and sandblast it, and that's gonna be a while. But I'm gonna get the tire back on, and then I'm gonna head back home because we gotta eat dinner. Dinner! And but yeah, that. We're gonna have to find a way to get that hub off. Probably gonna have to trailer it back and do to drag it, because, well, that hub is stuck. Or not the hub, the brake drum is stuck on there. But yeah, that's it for this video. And hope you guys enjoyed it, and we will hopefully another one soon.